Okay, welcome to Mr. Hassan's math channel. Um, I'm going to explain in this video, uh, for those of you who are new to my channel, how to use my channel um, in an efficient way to find those uh, items that you're looking for um, in an efficient manner. Okay, so um, if you come to this channel, you'll see, for example, these playlists. They might not, you know, be arranged in a way that is um, suitable for yourself. You might be looking for, for example, you might be an IGCSE student taking the Cambridge um, board and you might not know where to look to find exactly what you're looking for. You might be a an AS student taking Edexcel or an A-level a, a student taking Edexcel, International A-level um, a Edexcel or International A-level Cambridge or the UK um, Edexcel um, A-level. You could be taking any of those and you might not be able to find what you're looking for very easily just by you know looking at this main page. So I'm going to show you what I've done to make it easy for you to navigate through my channel depending on what you have now or depending on what you're looking for. Now before there were some banners on the um, or some links on this banner that's how they you know that, that was a quick way to get to certain things but the, the YouTube have re removed these banners for some reason now they don't do the banners anymore. So what you have to do is you have to go to this tab that says about. Okay, you might have to, if you're on a phone, have to like scroll across until you see about. If you click on this tab, it takes you to this description of the channel and some, you know, brief description. But down here, what you'll see here is links. Now that's, these links will help you to find what you're looking for. So for example, I have Edexcel International A-Level Index. CAIE means Cambridge Assessment International Exam, so the Cambridge IGCSE Index for the 0580 and 0980, which is basically the same syllabus. Um, Edexcel UK ASN A level and Cambridge International A level Edexcel, uh, sorry, Index, which is 9709. So the Cambridge International A level Index 9709. So each of these links will take you to the material that you're looking for. So for example, if you are taking um, Edexcel International A level. If you click on this link, it will take you to a Google Drive um, documents, which should open up quickly here. So here you've got basically M1, Mechanics 1, P1, P2, P3, P4, and S1. Okay, so th those are the units that I have material that covers. So for example, if you go to P1, you click on that, you'll see what I have here is uh, on the top of the page, I have um, the official papers from Edexcel. So I've got all the P1 papers up to the the last nine months. Okay, um, basically any paper that has been sat within the last nine months, I cannot upload those papers. So papers that are more than nine months old, you'll find that I have links to those papers. And so I've got these, if you click this link, for example, if you click, click on October 2021, for example, it will take you to my YouTube channel playlist for that particular paper. And you will find that you will see all the questions answered from that particular paper in this playlist. Okay. And that's the same for all these years. Okay. Oh, that I have here. You also have something else, which is the um, revision topics for P1. So for example, so I've answered questions and, and saved them according to the actual paper in the playlist up here. And I've answered the questions and I have saved them according to the topic down here. So some of these questions are from the papers. Some of them are from the textbook. Some of them are from other sources. But the, those are the questions I've answered which relate to P1 in International A Level Excel, which I've, I've saved those videos in the in this manner okay so for example if you have a problem with say um let's say differentiation in p1 okay you click on this link it will take you to the playlist and in this playlist you'll see that all the different questions i've answered on differentiation in p1 will be in this equations of tangents and normals and so on okay including questions from the book and whatever so any questions i've answered dealing with this particular topic p1 differentiation will be in this playlist okay and if you click on this side it has p1 textbook video solution so for example here um if you uh, click 
uh, in one of these. For example, if we go to say chapter eight or chapter nine, any any of these. For example, chapter nine, you'll see that. Well, this one doesn't have any videos in it yet, but um, basically any question that I have been asked to answer from the P1 textbook, I will um, upload the question, the answers here. So let me just choose another one. For example, chapter five as well, nothing in here so far. Let's see chapter seven. Okay, chapter seven, radiant measure. I have answered all these questions from the textbook here. So I only answer these questions upon request. Okay, so that's why some of those are empty because some no one has asked me to answer those questions. But if you do have a question that you want me to answer from the textbook, Okay, I, whether it's P1, P2, P3, M1, or S1, okay, you can just send me a comment on the um, channel and I will, as soon as possible, try to answer those questions. Okay, so that's, um, you know, the past papers, topics, and the actual textbook. Okay, so where I've got, I've tried to collate things according to the playlist, according to uh, that to help it, help you try to find things easily. Okay, and then at the bottom of this page, I then also have links to all the other parts. So, for example, we just looked at the um, the page now that that will take you back to that same page. If I click on this IGCSE past papers or the US uh, UK AS A level Cambridge AS and A level will take you to those things. So, for example, if if you want to look at the UK AS and A level, okay, I don't have that much answered in this because I I mainly deal with international a level but anything sometimes i answer questions related to international a level uh, papers from the uk papers because they're very similar so if i if you click on this it takes you to um the a level so here you have a uh, a um, index that opens up which will take you to some papers now, i haven't answered uh, you know all the questions from these papers only the only some of them that relate to what I am teaching in international A level and I find useful, I've answered some of those. Okay, so that's what I've done here. Okay, so that's um, that's for the UK A level. All right, and you'll also see that there's there's a link here with the topics as well. So here I've clicked together all those topics to do with um, the A level from um, the UK, but there are a lot of overlap. So some questions here. You'll see, you'll see some of these playlists. You'll see questions from the international A level as well. Right? But I've done the the topics according to that. Um, you also will find that I have. Um, if you go back to uh, this, you'll see I have CIE IGCSE index for. This is for the IGCSE Cambridge. Okay, so I have again two different indexes. One is for the past papers so again i have answered some of them completely like for example the specimen paper and also the february march paper this is for the 0580 and 0980 as well okay from 2002 onwards so i have answered the specimen papers i've answered the february march paper i've answered some of these papers completely but some of them not completely because there's so, so many variants you see so if you have a question from any of these papers that you want me to answer okay and i haven't answered that question you can just request it okay so for example if i click on this have i answered any of these i'll answer three of those questions all right question three nine and two okay and if you want me to answer more of those questions from this particular paper then you just request it tell me the paper the variant and the year and i will answer those questions okay and then you also have um, as I mentioned, if you go back to here, you'll have the topic index. Okay, so you, if you have a problem with a particular topic um, in the IGCSE, you can click on something like, for example, number patterns and sequences. You click on that and you'll see that these are all the questions I've answered from past papers which are dealing with number patterns and sequences. Okay, so that's, um, you know, how you can use my channel by using these index um, indices that you, indexes that you can find here so you've got here these links on the page which is about 
They will take you to what you're looking for and then you can find exactly what you need without having to do all these searches on the playlists and stuff. Everything is organized in these links over here. So um, if you have any questions that you want to ask me from the past papers or from the textbook, whatever, you're welcome to ask. And if I have time, I will answer them as soon as I can. So that's about that for this video. Hopefully this will help you to navigate my channel in an efficient manner. Um, thank you for watching and I hope that you use and benefit the, from the channel as you know um, the intention is for me for you to do. Thank you for watching and see you soon.